hey guys so this video is totally dedicated to all my sisters yeah you can see the spelling out there so before I begin I would like to share my story so back in 2017 I had this excruciating pain in my stomach and I was admitted in the hospital uh, later I was diagnosed with a cyst on my right ovary but unfortunately it already bursted so they had to surgically remove my right ovary then I was like bedridden for like after my operation I was bedridden for almost three months I had to drop out like drop a semester of my university and all I thought okay it was it but unfortunately after three months to recovery I was diagnosed with another cyst on my only one and only ovary left which was my left one so it was pretty hard for me for a girl in her 20s to lose a ovary is a very big deal I mean even if it's an organ you cannot see but the feeling is quite mutual as you know losing a limb or something so the purpose of me making this video is for those women out there who's suffering, who's going through the same as me. Like if you have cysts in your ovary and right now you're searching for different remedies, different ways to cure it. I just want to tell you guys that one thing is that, hear me out. It's really good to share with each other. It's really good to share your problem with someone who's going through the same. Actually, word heals a lot rather than medicine and all. Even though there is no cure for this, I know. And you have to control a lot of things, your lifestyle and everything. Honestly, I believe that PCOS is a blessing of its kind because we have a reason to take care of ourselves and all. And... There are nights when I have a total breakdown because, you know, when I think like I have only one ovary left at the same time, being a person who loves kids, even the thought that I might not have babies, who knows, I may have, may have not, but it does hurt me and there are nights I cry. And then I go to these forums where they're talking about PCOS, they're talking about their feelings, their sufferings and how they're you know fighting it and I when I read that I feel like I'm not alone so if you're watching this I'm gonna tell you that you are not alone and I know not everyone understands you but who are going through same as you they know what you're going through they know about those nights of pain in your stomach they know about those like you know delay in period the shooting hormones which gives you really bad mood swings but yet you have to keep a smile on your face and deal with the world the facial hair everything that makes you feel like less of a woman but you're not you are a warrior you're more more than that you're an amazing woman who's fighting right now so please do not worry and there are a lot of ways i take care of my hair my skin my weight and you know my sanity so if you want i can make more videos out of it and do comment if you want I, i'll hear you out i'll share you with you my experience while you can share with me yours and at the same time i will be giving my instagram link in the description box at the same time i'm planning to open a group in facebook where we can talk with each other where we can create a forum where everyone can share their real life experiences so do comment if you want me to open up something like that support me and i want to support you as well just want to tell you that i don't know how you're feeling right now but if you come across this video and if you're watching it till the end i just want to say that you're amazing and there are so many other women going through the same as you. So don't feel like you're alone in this. Okay? Take care.